have your phone. Oh, uh, my mom. Yeah. Call her when I get home. You're not giving her any grandbabies. Say the word, I'll set you up. I got cousins. Yeah, I've met your cousins. They're lovely. Maybe after I make chief. Whoa. Hey, Scotty. Oh. This is huge. There's food, a leash, some toys. This one's his favorite. Mr. Orsi. What are you talking about? Did mom call you? Your father wanted you to have Hooch. He rescued him from the shelter. He said it was almost like the original Hooch came back. I can't take care of him. I'm working all the time, and I, I'm just still trying to prove myself here, mom. Come on. You're going to love him. No, 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 no. Your no. Hooch, no, no, no. <laughs> sit, sit, sit. You're gonna be fine. Laura, I'm late for work. Scott, we've got an emergency here. Three males driving a silver suburban. Wait, wait, silver suburban? I see him, I'm in pursuit. Oh my! How did this happen? Also, why is there a dog in the office? Uh, uh it's, it's a long story, sir. Everybody needs somebody sometime. He's just totally out of control. I don't know what to do. I think I might know someone you can talk to. Erica, meet Scott. Hi. I, I'll let you two chat. If there's anything you can do, I'm desperate. He's just totally untrained. Pooch, sir. Down. Good. Wow. He behaves for everyone but me. Somebody sometime. Dad wrote it before he passed. Dear Scotty, I know you think you don't want a dog. But everything I care about in my life started with a dog. I think we'd see something that we don't. <sighs> Didn't see that coming. Great job. Get the dog out of here. No! That dog remains a disaster waiting to happen. He's just taking the water for contaminants. We are totally focused on Hooch's training. He's getting better every day. Thanks for all the help, Hooch. <laughs> just met you and I think that's a good sign. Uh, I am so sorry. Is he yours? Uh, yeah, unfortunately. Everybody needs somebody sometimes.